This video will give you an overview of track changes and comments. I use track changes and comments when providing feedback on your documents that I return to you. Um, this document that you see is marked up with both track changes and comments. Some changes appear in the body of the text, some changes, formatting changes, other things appear in the markup area at the right. Comments also appear in the markup area. There are four main views to view your document when uh, viewing track changes. If you click the review tab, and then go to the tracking group. If you click the display for review drop down list, uh, you'll pr most likely want to use all markup. That way you can see everything in the document. Displays all the comments, all the changes that I've made. So again, some will be in the markup area, some will be within the document. Another view is no markup. No markup view accepts all the changes that I have put into the document. So this incorporates all of those changes. If you want to see your original document, you can click the Display for Review drop down list and choose Original. And that will display your original document without any of the changes I've inserted. If there are too many uh, changes over here in the markup view, all this information will become collapsed and the way that the best way to view it is to click the reviewing pane drop down list and choose reviewing pane vertical and it will show all of the different uh, changes and changes that have been tracked and comments that have been made in the reviewing pane. To turn off the reviewing pane you can click on the reviewing pane button again. Another option for displaying how track changes appear in your document is in the Show Markup drop-down list. If you click on Show Markup, click on Balloons, probably the best way to view it is with Show Only Comments and Formatting in Balloons. That way all the revisions made will be in the text in the body of the document. So you can see something's been deleted, something's been deleted here and added. If you put your pointer over any of the changes, the comments will come up on there, such as this one here. The other way is to click the show markup, click balloons, and click show revisions in balloons. More of the revisions will show up in the markup area at the right. Also in the show markup area, when you click this drop down list, um, ensure or check to make sure that the, all of these four items are checked comments, ink, insertions, and deletions, and formatting. That way, everything will display in your document. If you want to accept all the changes in your document, um, you can click on the, ex the bottom half of the accept button and select select all or accept all changes and stop tracking that will turn off tracking and it will apply all the changes I've made in the document and then you could also click on in the comments area click in the bottom half of the delete button and choose delete all comments in the document and now you have a clean document with all of the changes accepted a quick review. Um, this document is shown in simple markup view with just lines over at the left over here to display where changes have been made. Probably the best view is to select all markup from the uh, display for review drop down list. And then also in the show markup area, make sure that these four items are checked. In the balloons area, select um, show only comments and formatting in balloons to display most of the markup within the document. I hope this information helps.